Yes, Grandma, it's a beautiful picture. Do you remember me? Your hands are frail and cold. Maybe I should just get you another blanket. Are you cold? You must be cold. Let me fix your pants. I am counting the moments where I am sure she is not looking through me. I am mostly aware of how young I am next to you, trying to understand the workings of a mind that has gone so far that it is now moving in reverse. Mm -hmm. I wonder when each one disappeared, which morning it was that you forgot my name, which morning it was that you forgot my birthday. You were the first love I ever watched forget me. Mm -hmm. I take away the only wisdom I can, that you will hold my hand when I reach for it, that you will lean on me if you lose your balance, that, you will, trust that where you will trust where I am taking you. That love is not based on fond memories or time, but resides somewhere that cannot be affected by shortcomings of the mind. Mm -hmm. I am happy you never had to think about loving me. That would mean it could have been taken away by this infection. Instead, mm -hmm. I hold on to the only truth I can depend on. That though I can be taken from your mind, I am in your heart until it stops. Mm -hmm. Yes, Grandma, it is a beautiful picture. I feed you yogurt. You've forgotten how to chew. Nurses force feed it to you. You fight them, but they don't love you enough to grant you their patience. I am only here once a week, and sometimes I don't come. Please don't hate me for my irresponsibility, for forgetting you sometimes, too, for being anything like my uncle. I promise I will never leave my mother like he did you. Mm. You touch my face every time I see you. I'm never sure how to leave. I sit in front of you and make you promises about seeing you soon, promises that you are loved as I leave you in this hospital. I always wave and blow you kisses as you leave and I, as I leave, and I remember when you stopped waving back. Mm -hmm. I wonder how often you look up for someone you recognized and found no one. Mm -hmm. I wonder how often you forgot and did it over again and over again. I hope it wasn't every second of every day. My mother told me you love to sing, and I can almost remember that. I sing to you as often as I could, whatever songs came to mind. Don't think me evil. I am not sure why I cry so much, knowing more memories of you like this than childhood memories that clouded over the years. I'd imagine you remember me much like I remember you, just as a feeling. I fear not your death, but the possibility that my mother one day will be sitting where you are. I hear that Alzheimer's is hereditary, but I am too scared to check. Yes, Grandma, it's a beautiful picture. Wow!